Good morning, guys. I did a poll on Instagram and asked what kind of videos you wanted to see and you guys asked for vlogs, so I'm giving you vlogs. To be honest with you guys, I literally woke up like half an hour ago and had breakfast and now I'm just back in bed. I also slept in fake tan last night, so like, Love the 50 different shades I've got going on right now. Apparently it's International Tan Day today, so I didn't even plan that, but that worked out really well. My face is so white. Guys, I literally look like a ghost right now. Man, it ain't even October, but it is spooky season up in here with this white face, like. It's Sunday, so we didn't make like a schedule last night or anything. I feel like you have to have days off during the week to just like, literally just vibe out and do whatever you want, so. That's what today is. I'm gonna go shower because I literally like, I can't look at this any longer. Okay, I just washed my tan off. You know what? I really just cannot stand looking at this hair. I'm gonna quickly do my hair and then I'll be back. Okay, I feel so much better now. Guys, I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the quarantine, but I've literally been obsessed with wearing my hair long at the moment. Also, you can really tell that I like dyed my extensions at home. Okay, so I'm gonna do some skincare. This is normally like the first thing I do when I wake up because I'm like the worst at waking up. I'm just so angry and tired. So I have to like do some skincare to just like wake the f up. I'm not gonna go through like every single product that I use because I don't really know if you guys care, but this is the Ordinary Nicetamine, my holy grail. Really though, like how are you guys? I feel like it's kind of like, just starting to hit me that this quarantine isn't like a week or two thing like this is life this is how it's going to be for a while also love this like color difference i don't know like i feel like the first week or two i was so productive and was like this is great because i feel like over winter when i was working full time i like didn't have as much time to film and edit because I'm like trying to work and then trying to spend all of my time snowboarding. So it's kind of nice to have some time to just like do my shit, like film and edit and work on my social media. But then on the other hand, it's kind of like really weird knowing that I'm on a working holiday and I'm like not working and not really on a holiday. I don't even know if I'm leaving the house today, but every single morning I put on an SPF, so but yeah, I don't know. I'm kind of torn because, yeah, I love having all this time, but I'm also like, this is all I can do right now. Having a schedule has definitely been working for me. I love like knowing what I meant to do that day and like having a set plan and making sure I'm being productive. But the last like couple of days, like really just this weekend, I've just not followed a schedule or planned anything. I've just like woken up and gone with the flow and it's been really good. I feel like having that balance between like, doing so much and then just like chilling out because the whole world is so like slowed down right now. It's been really good. What else do I want to tell you guys? Oh, honestly, just being in front of the camera right now and saying what's on my mind feels so good. I love filming sit down videos where I'm like telling you guys about something or sharing something with you guys. Like I really love just sharing my experiences and like hoping it helps someone or inspires someone or I don't necessarily think I'm always doing the right thing, but just if I can help someone, then I want to share my stuff with you guys. But right now, just standing in front of the camera, speaking my mind, not having like a script or dot points. This feels good. Like I'm loving this. Oh, another thing I really wanted to talk to you guys about, because I feel like I just want to get this off my chest. I downloaded this app that Cal told me about that he uses heaps. So I'm just like drying the excess SPF off on the towel. I don't know if that's like what you're meant to do, but. Anyway, I downloaded this app called Skillshare. It's where you can like, do all these classes that people upload on basically like any topic. So Cal was doing heaps of like graphic design ones and stuff like that in the summer. And when we went into quarantine, I was like, okay, I should totally download the app. I'll start doing some like social media classes and photography and filming and kind of like, how do you build up a social media following sort of thing? Cause that's what I'm looking to do. I don't know guys, I'm like really torn cause some of the things they say, I totally love and I've definitely gotten some tips from it. And some of the other things, I don't know, 
they just feel like super cringy to me. I'm all about hashtags on photos and like posting at the right time. Like that stuff I'm like, yeah, it's sweet. That can totally just like help you without being so like fake, I suppose. Some of the things they say are like, shout out for shout out like follow for follow spending hours commenting on people's photos and i don't know you guys like that's just not what i'm about so this eye cream has been sitting on my finger for a while but it is the burt's bees sensitive yeah burt's bees sensitive eye cream not my favorite but i'm all about like using a product up before getting a new one maybe it'll work for you if you have sensitive eyes but i don't know not about it yeah there's just something about not getting a following organically that just like doesn't sit with me like for sure if someone comments on my things or you know subscribes to my channel and is like hey like i have a channel check it out 100 percent for sure i'm totally gonna take the time to check out your channel but like if i don't like it i don't want to be like best videos ever i love it i totally want people to keep making content regardless of whether i like it or not because if that's your passion like go for it but i don't know i don't want to spend my time just like leeching and trying to like get followers so much maybe that means my content will never get a good reach or maybe i'll just never get a good following but i just feel like i'd rather get it organically than just i don't even know the word i don't i don't know <laughs> like i can't even imagine paying for followers or I don't know, just all of that time spent on just worrying about who's watching your stuff rather than your actual content just doesn't sit right with me, guys. I don't know, just feels a bit off. All right, my skincare is done. I feel 1000%, is that even? I feel like a thousand percent better when I have my skincare done. I feel like I can actually do the day. Like if I get up and don't do skincare, it's just not, like I'm not awake. I I have to do skincare. Okay, I'm gonna put some makeup on because I don't even know what we're doing today, but I feel like I just wanna look like good. I know like look good, feel good. But I'm gonna do my makeup. I'm not gonna film it because I'm really bad at doing makeup and I just don't wanna get roasted in the comments, so. Be right back. I feel like I want to listen to like Justin Bieber's album. Is that okay? Yeah, that's fine. Okay, I just finished my makeup. I also put some curls in my hair because I feel like the extension straight is just like too fake looking. So I don't know. I feel like this is better. So now that I'm all glam to go absolutely nowhere, let's <laughs> let's start the day. I'm not really sure what we're doing, but figure it out. First off, I really need to do the dishes from breakfast and make our bed because we live in a studio. So if you don't like tidy up as you go and do those little things, the whole place just literally, the whole place just literally looks trashed. I feel like those of you who have partners working from home will understand but I find it so hard during the day to like not distract Cal because I'm like I just want to hang out I don't know I feel like he's working and I'm just every five minutes just being like what you doing still working I just want to hang out with you will you come stretch with me what are you saying about not distracting can you take a break soon will you come stretch with me sure He left the chat. <laughs> okay, so Cal and I have been doing Kayla. Is it it signs? Yeah. But I always go itness, but I think it's just because it sounds like fitness. Anyway, we've been doing Kayla it signs BBG like bikini body twelve week challenge, and guys, it is absolutely like whooping my ass it is so hard I feel like if there's ever a time to like start a 12 week challenge or do like any kind of fitness challenge in general it's now because like i have 12 weeks i have so many weeks to dedicate to this so today is our last day 
Oh my god, phlegm in my throat, gross. <laughs> I literally like can't speak. I just went completely blank. So today is our last day of week two, which is a day purely for stretching. This is probably like my favorite day of the week. So I'm gonna stretch. I think Cal, are you gonna join me? Absolutely. Cal's gonna stretch as well. All right, let's do it. Down, yeah. I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so. Down, yeah. Can you tell me why? Can you tell me why? I'm down, yeah. No friends of mine, no friends of mine around, yeah. Now I'm thinking now, now I'm thinking now. Why the cottage room blows? Yeah, I wanna try myself inside the juice. Can you show me how to do this other stretch? Yeah. Okay. So, like this? Yeah. And it stretches. <laughs> Stretches the line on the bottom. And then... Ah! Ah! Okay, you definitely can't do this for socks. <laughs> okay guys, so we've decided that for the rest of the day, we're going to build a snowman. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just looking at Cal with sticks right now. So we decided we're going to build a snowman and build a fort. Like just up here to the left, I'll show you guys in a second. There's this really good spot where you can like get this really nice view of the mountains. So we want to build like a fort kind of sitting area i guess like a nice like sitting area so that at night time we can take photos of the mountains so that's what we're doing we're building a snowman and we're building a fort because it's getting into spring guys like the snow is starting to melt so every step you take it's literally like russian roulette like i could fall through <laughs> the snow at any moment and i don't know like i know it's just snow and i won't like really hurt myself i just get so scared I really hate that falling feeling. It's kind of cloudy at the moment, so you can't really see the mountain, but these are the mountains, guys. Also, when you actually climb up to where the fort is, this tree isn't just like smack bang in the middle in the way. So, so far, guys, we have this platform up there, I guess. Is that gonna be where we sit? Yeah. Yeah. Sound like an old pallet. All right, guys, this is the fort so far. So we're sitting on the pallet and then you can see like behind us is the shelter that Cal was building. So I love it. Do you like it? It's I good. think it's freaking awesome. There's still a few holes in it. But... Yeah, we're still going to like add to it. It's not finished yet, but I want to show you guys like so far, this is where we're at. We literally have used the trees to like hang our jackets and bags, but this is the view that you get from it. And that mountain like just, ugh, my hand, like just up there to the left is the one that's like really nice and pointy. So we feel like when it's not cloudy, that's gonna be the best one to get the photos of the stars at. A little bit nervous of like other people finding it. Especially now that I'm like, hey, this is the fort. If you find the fort, like don't ruin it, okay? Like you can enjoy it, but like don't tear it down. I don't think anyone would tear it down. No, I don't think so either, but like, I feel like I just need to put that like PSA out there. Like don't ruin the fort. <laughs> what do you want to do now? Can we build the snowman? Mm -hmm. Yes. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay. All right, guys, we're going to build a snowman. Oh my god guys this is way too cute look it's a snowman and there's the fort do you like it i think it's turned out pretty good i think it's awesome i can't wait to like spend nights here just taking photos all right guys i'm gonna end this video here oh my gosh i'm loving this hug night good night goodbye no but seriously we're gonna go watch something on disney plus trying to use like all the days of the seven day trial wisely i just i'm gonna go to bed I love you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will see you soon, I guess. Bye!